in this video we will learn about remote desktop option if you want to remotely access your computer or want a, someone to look at your system by remotely connecting to your you can use remote desktop we can start remote desktop by typing remote and you can see over here remote desktop connection click on it and this is the interface you need to enable this before uh, someone can connect to your computer uh, for remote assistance or just access to your computer and you can go over here and type setting and First we need to go to the system, and system. And over here you can click and on the left side you can see remote settings click on this one and on this window you can see uh, remote assistant so over here we have check all remote assistant and for remote desktop here you can select these one of these options over here currently selected it don't allow uh, if you want to allow others to connect to your computer you can do this one it's uh, less secure and click on it apply and then click OK and you can see a computer name over here if it you need it i will try to access this uh, my computer from a local ip address you can also use external ip to use uh, i will show you both ways first i'm going to use a local ip so in my local network i am accessing uh, from one computer to another one and i will type over here on the command prompt IP config it will give me the IP address of this computer where I have enabled the remote desktop and from here I'm going to select or this IP this one is the IP that I need on a other computer such as this remote desktop connection and then I have to just enter uh, the IP address over here for example, if I copy from here, copy, and on other uh, your desktop or laptop, and you can use remote desktop connection, not in the same one, because we want to connect from other one, and you need to type the IP address of that computer that you need to connect to, and then it will may ask you for the username and password, and uh, you can enter that and you will be connected to this system or if you want uh, someone uh, uh, from outside of your network to connect to your system you can use uh, ip the external ip the, of this uh, system for example if i go over here you can look for what is my IP and you will get the external IP address of your system the first one was for local network and your public IP address so that this one you can copy that one and the remote user can connect to with this IP over here and just connect I will try to connect to this system from my other remote desktop connection uh, from my other laptop remote. And on my other one I will use this local IP address and 
on my other system, it's asking me for username and password. I need the pa username and password for the system I'm connecting to. And then you will get an option uh, for the certificate and then you will be able to connect to I am now connected to my uh, remote system and I can type a command and I'm just going to log out. So this way you can use the remote desktop connection and enable it on your system so others users can uh, connect to it or you need a remote assistance to keep on learning please subscribe to my youtube channel a sim code keep supporting me and thank you for watching